depending on what they call a vulnerable injury for a variety of reasons. The first thing is that I really the person in the state of the home and the time of the day is called collagen. Great form. Therefore, the time in itself is to get older and more susceptible to injury. It's also susceptible to injury as a result of decreased space, the local effects of the community's two body. When you have decreased space, either from the cell or costume, where your shoulders are all rolled forward, that can be true, so they are going to get a cost more susceptible to injury. Have an inflammation from the eye or not to the rest of the cup. So, for the cup, it's also susceptible to the injury from the cup of the other canal event. The rest of the cup can range from an inflammation or a tendonitis in the rest of the cup, then it's from a partial tear to a full thickness tear. When the patient presents with these injuries, we look at the extent of the injury, then we can make sure that it's clear, and the patient can learn that. And based on the extent of the injury, we can start with an injection, physical therapy, anti inflammatory, and rest from aggravating activity, all the way to surgery to where the larger tear of the rest of the cup. Other type of surgery is to remove small incisions in the skin and use long incisions about the size of a pen or a pencil that allow us to look within the joint or above the joint to take the rest of the cup of pen uh, with the scanner and then use small instruments to help us bring the pen and back to the joint. In the case of the rest of the cup of pen, we place an anchor or screw generally into the bone and we keep the material with the screw to pen and back down onto the bone where it belongs. Following the care of the rest of the cup, it's important to allow that pen and screw back onto the bone. Then we put approximately 46 weeks to put in a space in the skin. This allows the tendon to repair back down and start to stretch the cup for two pieces. For that time period, we do generally have to start the center of any divination program under the guide of the physical therapist. At the end of the um, time of the swing, we get more breath of any divination exercises and then strengthen the program. Generally, generally at 12 weeks, most patients are back to a full activity. Overhead activities at the state of the camp are generally the last activity.